So obviously, you know, the concert got canceled. There's hundreds of millennials just walking around. We were going to check out the Taco Bell Cantina because I heard that they have like a heart slushies and things like that. So I really wanted to try one. Right now, it's super packed. So we're gonna come back later. I think we're gonna hit up Fremont because we heard that a lot of the concert people were gonna be hanging out there and hopefully make it kind of like a hangout spot for those that didn't, obviously that didn't make it to the concert as it's canceled. So let's get going to Fremont. We got to Freeman Street. It was very lively with festival goers trying to make the best of a terrible situation. We walked around and checked out a few stores, but our first stop was Banger Spring. They were doing happy hour all day, which was really cool. The place was packed, but the vibe was great. And we ended up just enjoying a beer there before deciding to walk around some more and do more exploring. All right, so Freeman Street was I guess we don't really have so much, much to say about it. i never been there before, and it was exactly as I expected it to be, like all Vegas. Uh, it seemed like yeah, people were having a good time and having drinks. We are actually going back to Brewery Row. There were a couple of breweries that we did not get to check out yesterday, and I don't want to check them out, so we're going to go and see what type of beers they have, hopefully find somewhere to eat, and then... You know, the night, the afternoon is young because it's not night yet. I don't know what we're going to end up doing, but we'll figure it out. So let's go to the brewery. So once we got to Brewery Road, we decided to check out Neon Desert Brewing. They have a cool space. They have a lot of like neon signs and the bar, as you can see, it's like pink and bright green. Uh, people were super nice there. I really just enjoy our time there. We ended up getting a flight to try a couple of their beers, which was really good. So then we headed over to Craft House to check out some of their beers. We ended up getting another flight as well. The one that caught our attention was their pumpkin spice beer slushy as you can see here i'm going to be trying it out it's actually a very strong and flavorful drink the pumpkin spice definitely comes through a lot it was tasty i really liked it but it was definitely like this little four ounce it was like too much for me i had like maybe a few drinks and then adam really liked it and he finished it for me but it was it was cool so it's 11 o'clock 11 10 to be exact after the breweries we were trying to find food and it was quite a disaster as this trip has been in general um but we ended up finding a little place that sells uh, vegan sandwiches so we order some and scarf them down and I didn't even get a video of it. And then we didn't really have anything to do. So we decided to go see the Katy Perry play for a show that's called Play here in Vegas. Tonight was her last, last show. And that turned out to be pretty awesome. Um, which I really enjoyed it. It was very colorful. She plays some good songs that I knew. She plays some other songs that I didn't know. Uh, but it was really really good right now Adam and I are just enjoying our big daiquiri drink and then we're gonna head over to a casino to play some games and then <laughs> and then just uh, head over to the Airbnb to pack take a quick nap and then head to the airport so it's been a crazy day but can't complain. We made the best of it. I think overall, I enjoyed what we ended up doing today, even though it was like low key. And then we ended up at a concert. So totally unexpected. But yeah, so we're going to go play now. And I'll see you later. So after gambling for a bit and walking around, we decided to get a refill of our daiquiri slushy and also a beer before calling it a night. Honestly, this Vegas trip did not go as planned at all, but we try to make the best of it. We hope that you enjoy our adventure and that you join us on the next one. Bye-bye.